Uh, hi, uh, today I'm going to show you how to make a very simple foam. Uh, this is the uh, soap dispenser, liquid soap dispenser. And, uh, the shape pretty simple. It's like a, a ball, a upside down ball. And, uh, it's different from uh, you pull it out and this time I'm going to uh, try to pull in. And uh, this is very simple to make. Um, you just add, uh, attach this uh, ring to your pot. Um, it could be a, a very useful soap dispenser. Um, I like this shape because it's wider so when you pump it, it's not easy to tip over. Um, it's very easy to get the uh, this pump from the clay supply store. Just like this, and uh, you attach this to uh, your uh, ceramics, and you cut to the length you like. Um, it's easy to make. Um, the uh, attached part, you just use the uh, ceramic glue. Uh, it's easy to get from clay supply store too. Okay, so this clay is about two to three pounds of uh, porcelain. So I'm going to uh, center it down a little bit wider so that uh, the bottom it stay in the, the base that is wider. After that, I'm opening the hole. Because this one, I'm not going to trim the bottom, so the bottom has to be uh, the exactly uh, thickness. I would say about uh, a quarter of an inch thick. And you want to spray the bottom so it's out wider. The bottom is finished, now I'm going to lift it up, this part, lift the wall. So instead of pulling it outward, you want to pull inward. Basically it's the, uh, the thumb and the four fingers lifting. Because this is short, so your thumb can reach the bottom.
before I close it further, uh, you want to use the metal rib to smooth the uh, bottom part. I usually use this metal rib because uh, it's easy to bend and you can see that uh, that's the curve. When I'm shaping it, I just push the clear wall against the rib so I will have a nice curve. Kind of a dip and pinch a little bit and you pull from this part and try to uh, uh, move the clay into the center.
So this is it. It's very easy. It looks like the a, a upside down ball. Uh, instead of you pull it out, you pull in inward, and uh, you, you just cut it. And it's easy and simple to make. And you don't need a trim.